Francisco Sicari, and welcome to the awareness section of this video. We usually talk about important dates and raise consciousness amongst the student body. However, for the first edition, we wanted to raise awareness on how to survive the crop, or high school in general. Now, here are some videos to present that. Um, stay on top of your work and build good relationships with your teachers, because then they can recommend you to better classes next year. Don't fall behind and get remedial work if you need it. And um, uh, <laughs> I would tell them to really enjoy their time as sophomores, because then junior year it gets way harder. Don't slack off. It's not a good thing. It's not a good thing to slack off. Stay on your work, and even if you want to be popular and talking to all your friends and everything, it's not worth it. Your education is more worth it than friends that you might not see in the future. I totally suggest you to start the SAT early, as soon as you can, and um, have fun. Particularly if you screwed up like I did the first part, you know, make it better. Keep making it better. Try, try to join clubs your friends are in, that way you're the most entertained while you're getting something to show. Seniors, my advice to you is to enjoy it. Please, please, please enjoy this last year. Um, it goes by very quickly. Go to prom, go to grad bash, go to all the events, make lots of relationships, keep in contact with each other, and don't forget to do your homework because senior year still counts. This is my advice for all you seniors out there. Make sure you work hard all the way to the very end because the teachers want to make sure that you're successful in the future. And then once you get to college, shh, don't tell anybody else this little secret, but stay in college as long as you can. Good luck. To all the freshmen, sophomores, juniors, and seniors, have an amazing year. Hi everyone, I'm Elizabeth Holmes. And I'm Amelia Isaacs. Welcome back to Crop Entertainment News. This month and every month, we're going to be telling you all the things you can do at Crop. Hence the name, Entertainment News. Well, anyway, on Wednesday, September the 5th, we had our first club fair. The club fair was a great opportunity to see the wide range of, the wide range of clubs that Crop has to offer. The blood drive is on September 11th and the 12th, and students must be at least 17 years old to donate. Does that mean you're finally old enough to donate? There's a PTSA-sponsored dress-down day on the 28th for $2. And on the same day, the second pep rally of the school year is our football home opening pep rally. Well, it's about that time, folks. See you, See you next month! month.